Hi everyone, it's Bettina. Today is Friday, January 27th, 2012. Alright, so this is going to be part four, hopefully, of these videos with my IBM 5150. Check out my other parts if you haven't already. Alright, so today what we're going to do is we're going to show you the printer and how that works. So, let me get up a little bit closer and I'll show you the printer first of all and I'll tell you how that works. So, the IBM 5150 had a printer and I can't remember the model number, but it's certainly um, 51 something, 51... 52, 53, 54, 55, I have no idea. It's on the back. It's Friday night. I've already had a couple glasses of wine, so I really don't care. Anyway, let's take a look and see what's going on here. So, first things first, I want to show you how to load the paper. It took me a little while to figure out. Now, I know it might be hard to see, but this actual part here would have a whole bunch more paper in the back here. It'd be spooled up or falling behind the desk. However, the last piece kind of ripped off, so I've just got this part on. So what you have to do is you have to get it underneath this roller here. There's a plastic roller here, and it's going to go underneath this, uh, this, this carriage or this paper separator from the top. And you're going to feed it all the way in, and let me flip this up here. And what you would do is you would throw that back, and then you would slide it underneath. It would, call, it would actually slide... Uh, easily if you if you if you pushed it in it'll come up around the front here and then these uh, carriage return arms or whatever you want to call them would be flipped up they come up and down and you uh, line it up appropriately so it's parallel to the front of face uh, to the front of the printer face and you should be okay flip those down put that back close the cover and away you go uh, the buttons we have here is power ready no paper which is good that's off and we have online, which is on, which is good. Form feed, if you want to advance the paper by one sheet. And line feed, which will advance it one at a time, which isn't working. I don't know why that's not working, because it was last time. Anyway, uh, let's print something out. So what I'm going to do is I'll show you how to print. There is a print screen button. I'm just going to show, I'm going to print out what's on the screen right now. So I'm just going to do a print screen. And that button is right uh, there. Is that it? That's it there. So we just have to hit the uh, shift up, which I can't do really right now. Put my hand in here. Oh, and look at that. It's printing. I already printed this out the first time, so it's just printing it out again. There it is. You can see it right out there. So there you go. That's the IBM color graphics. Oh, sorry. Take that back. Not color. It's a graphics printer, dot matrix, of course. It's a classic, and uh, I love it. As you can see, my whole setup here is all IBM, 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 5150. All right, so that's it for the printer. And next uh, video might be the cassette recorder. We'll show you how to load some programs on that and how to take them back. All right, that's it for now. See you later.